Yay, yay! Let me get that good angle. What's up, people? Raider Nation. Coming to you from... What is the name of this town? Hooker, Oklahoma. <laughs> I'm on my way to Iowa. Been gone for a while. Obviously, you guys know that. I'm sorry. I got a new job with the new company and trying to... I've been here for a few months trying to get my feet wet. Things are going here and there. I've had my ups and downs, but at the end of the day, everything's good. Um, so, since I've last been on the YouTubes, uh, shit, we won four in a we like, was it one three in a row? Then we lost four in a row. For a minute there, it looked like my prediction of ten and six would come to fruition. But it ain't going to happen now. We lost a couple of... Uh, I think we went into a Jets game a few weeks back. Uh, we went in there overconfident and we got our asses handed to us. We've lost four in a row, I think, right? Until we won last week against the uh, San Diego Chokers. And despite that... We still got a chance of making the playoffs. 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 Say it ain't so. But I'll be honest. I'm going to be honest with you guys. <laughs> Say the stars align this coming up week against the Bronco Hose. We are. <laughs> I hate to say this. But I'm a realist. If if we miss, somehow make the playoffs, we'll be playing either the Chiefs or the Texans. I mean, what can I say? I mean, honestly, my, my belief, we're not a good team. I, I, I hate to say that. But we're not a good team, guys. I, 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 I know the truth hurts, but we're not a good team. Um, offensively, well, we, we have our moments. Uh, but defensively, our secondary is weak. And let's just say we do win our first game. Say it gets a char the Chargers. The Chiefs or the Texans. Let's say we do win that game. We'll be playing more than likely, since we're the number eight seed, we'll be playing probably the number one seed, which is the Ravens. I'll tell you right now, guys, it's not going to look good. I mean, I, I, I hate to say that, but it's the truth. But hey, whatever, you know. If we make the playoffs and we lose, it'll be a good experience, a good learning uh, experience for the, all the rookies and all the young players that we have moving forward to Vegas next year. Uh, what else? Oh, yeah. Uh, finally! Finally! Tom Flores, Clifford Branch, Hall of Fame finalist. Finally, Tom Flores well deserved. They say he couldn't make it because he had a couple of bad years towards the end of his career, uh, coaching career with the Seahawks. But that's just bias about the stupid NFL Hall of Fame. He deserved to be there in the beginning, but whatever. He's alive. He gets to see it. Now, the one thing that pisses me off to no end is the fact that Cliff Branch will not be able to 
experience this. His family will be there, obviously, to in his honor, but and Raider Nation as well. But the the NFL has been so biased towards the Raiders because of their hatred for Al Davis. Let me turn off this truck. Oh, I hope he. <laughs> the bias has been incredible. It's like NFL, get fucking over it. Get over it. Cliff Branch, he should have been inducted into the Hall of Fame back in the in the early 90s. It's just so sad, man. It is so sad. It almost brings a tear to my eye just thinking about that Cliff Branch passed away. In his deathbed, knowing that he won't be able to see that Hall of Fame, right, deservingly so, uh, labeled on him, just like Ken Stabler, the same way. It's bull. But congratulations to Tom Flores, Mexican American, not that that matters, but the fact I say that because obviously. If you know, he was the first minority head coach uh, in the NFL. I mean, there was, like, assistance, but not like a head coach. But whatever, you know. Um, It's just sad. It is so sad. Uh, I've had a couple of people send me some questions. After this video, I might do another one and, and answer some of those questions. But, uh, hey, check out my hat. You guys like my hat? Make the Raiders great again. Why not? So, anyways, that's it, guys. I love you all. I'm still alive. <laughs> I, you know what? I'm going to be honest. The reason why I haven't done videos, the Raiders lose, I get depressed, I get sad, I get emotional, and I'm just, I don't feel like doing videos, I'm sorry. That's basically it, you know. I hope everybody had a, has a, had, had a Merry Christmas. Today is the 26th of December, and I'm out here on the road. I wasn't, my, I wasn't be able to be with my family. Sacrifices that truckers make is that truckers make this country move. What that? You go to a Walmart. All, all that you see in the shelves at the Walmart was brought to you by a trucker. Working on Christmas, on New Year's, Fourth of July, Thanksgiving, whatever. <laughs> I'll be home next week, though, for my wife's birthday. You better believe that. But other than that, here I am. So it is what it is, guys. So I'm going to go ahead in this video. I love you all. Stay strong. Truckers be safe. Uh, look forward to this Broncos game on Sunday. Let's see how it goes. And if we lose, we lose. If we win and we make the playoffs, hey, whatever. Whatever happens, happens. So I love you all. Peace.